A Jacksonville University's College of Law officially opened today, even though classes have already started. News for Jack's reporter Jim Pickett was there to talk with those who were going to benefit. So I'm here on the 18th floor of the Vistar building downtown. That's across from the old landing site. And where I am, let me show you, this is actually the newest college in Jacksonville. It's JU's College of Law. They just did a ribbon cutting today, and what they do is this school has actually been open for about three weeks, but what's happening is this is now the classroom for some of the newest lawyers that we're going to be seeing here in Jacksonville. I'm just giving you a quick tour. One classroom right over here. They have the library and resource center. That is down around this area here, and you can see that this is going to be very active. But what's surprising right now is the first class is only 14 students, and we had a chance to meet up with one of them. How about a handshake? <laughs> They're called the Fabulous 14, the first-year law students at JU's new College of Law. Lauren Fisher is one of them. I feel amazing, honestly. I know that we get to be um, basically paving the way for many more students to come. Um, I definitely believe that we're trailblazers, and I'm definitely super excited to have a history here um, and to be able to basically practice law in basically the city I grew up in. She and these students are all getting some type of financial aid. Law school isn't cheap, about $36,000 a year. And as pointed out today, it's been a dream of JU's founders to have a law school. Today, 88 years later, that dream was realized. All right. During the ceremony today, Mayor Curry was on hand because the city has made a substantial investment in this, $5 million. We have uh, ideas pitched to us on any given day uh, to invest in. Uh, this is a real talent need in Jacksonville. Uh, JU, under the leadership of Tim Cost, has demonstrated the ability, when he has an idea, to get it done and to get it done successfully. So when he brought the idea to, this idea to me, um, it was ready to go. It's a no-brainer. I think it's much needed. It's going to be in downtown. The dean of the college says this money will pay off in many ways. So our graduates are, are going to be, uh, I'm sure, coming from and serving the legal needs of Jacks, Jacksonville, which are not only private and commercial, but in the... Uh, criminal and civil area. And that's exactly what first-year student Lauren Fisher wants to do when she graduates in three years. I do want to practice here in the city of Jacksonville and bring many more changes and many more opportunities to help individuals in need here. And they said this a number of times during this event today. If you've got an interest in law, well, they're taking applications for the school for the spring semester and for next year. Jim Pickett, Channel 4, The Local Station.